AFCO just uh, recently finalized building a live release boat. It's called the Bass Bus. And what that's designed to do, it's gonna travel across the country, you know, to different tournaments, such as, you know, the, the college bass fishing open here on Lake Dardanelle. So it's gonna travel throughout the United States and it is there to promote conservation as far as releasing the bass after tournaments back into the wild. Appreciate y'all fishing. Go right over and get a picture made and put them right there in your release boats. We've got the AFCO release boat here with us today. You know, we've installed the best equipment we possibly can in this boat to allow it to do the absolute best in reviving those fish after they've been in someone's live well or, you know, been hooked poorly or whatever it may be throughout the, you know, the course of their day. We've installed all that awesome equipment into that boat and that boat is designed to keep those fish alive. How about a 964, 964? A release boat is especially important during the summer months when it's extremely hot. On the release boat, they'll have fresh water that's circulating, lots of oxygen, a lot cooler water, which helps revive them. Everyone's familiar with fishing tournaments where you know fish get let go back in the muddy hot water right at the ramp and a lot of times uh, they might not survive or they just don't recuperate as quickly. So you got the live boat, they're gonna take them out in the middle of the lake and uh, make sure they're all taken care of and let go each one by one and make sure they're all swimming upright and ready to go. And that just again helps uh, preserve a fishery for years to come. <laughs> These small off are great. This is the youth. These are the people that are gonna have more years ahead of them to have to, you know, learn about conservation and learn about putting their best foot forward as far as uh, allowing to keep the fish alive and wanting to protect, you know, the resources that we have now. And that that's why we feel like events like this are important because we're able to get our name out there, preach what we know about it, and then hopefully it impacts these you know, the youth that is here and it goes into the future. We've seen a large push towards uh, preserving the, the safety of fish and bass tournaments. The AFCO Bass Bus release boat back here, just another one of those things that's gonna help preserve preserve our resources uh, for years to come and the fish themselves. AFCO having um, a live release boat really protects fishermen of the future, like myself. It's great to know that all the fisheries that we go to are being protected and um, that's a really big deal. I think more tournaments should adopt that and AFCO has taken initiative to make a step forward and protect the fisheries that they're sponsoring.